Good morning, DC. I'm Evan Frakes. And I'm Elijah. And here is your news for Tuesday, January 26, 2016. Today is National Peanut Brittle Day. We usually make a joke here, but peanut brittle is boring. So, Attention students that plan to attend CUNA. There will be a Y Club meeting tomorrow after school in Mr. Easley's room. If you absolutely cannot attend, please come to Mr. Easley's room Thursday morning at 7.45 for a makeup meeting. Key Club members, there will not be a meeting this Friday, January 29th. Our next meeting will be February 5th at 7.30 in room 238, so like, don't show up. Attention AP students, AP exam registration begins February 1st and closes on March 11th. The cost is $92 per exam. See the Davis County High School homepage or Mrs. Shaw for more details. Attention JCL members. See Ms. Chafisi in room 201 for your convention forms. The $50 deposit is due this Friday. Any questions? See Ms. Chafisi. Attention students. If you're taking the February ACT, make sure to take advantage of upcoming test prep sessions. Check your student emails from Ms. Colbert for more information. Attention students. CPR and first aid classes have been rescheduled for this Saturday, January 30th, from 8.30 a.m. to 12.30 p.m. in the Media Center. If you signed up and cannot attend, see Ms. Kimbrell ASAP for a refund. Attention driver's ed students from the first semester. If you have not picked up your completion certificate yet from Mr. Driscoll, you may do so during CCR this week. Attention students, intramural forms need to be turned in with money by tomorrow to Coach Brannon. Games will start this Sunday at 6.30 in the main gym after the girls' basketball game. Heads up, freshmen. All freshmen are invited to attend the Winter Frost Fest for free. Free! On Monday, February 1st. Free. Free! Pizza and drinks will be served at 5.45 p.m., followed by boys' and girls' basketball games. D.C. will play host to Apollo. The boys' game will begin at 7 p.m., and the girls will begin at 6. All class of 2019 members will be admitted for free. Free! With school ID. There will be spirit items and giveaways. A few class of 2019 t-shirts will be available for $10. A free, free sports bottle is included with purchase. Any questions, see Ms. Gimmeorn. DCHS graduate Katie Bouchard is collecting used eyeglasses as a part of her Spreading the Gift of Sight Around the World service platform for the 2016 Miss Kentucky pageant. Prescription, reading, and broken glasses can be accepted. Please send any used eyeglasses to the ZCHS Youth Service Center. Upperclassmen, the Hobie Leadership Academy is taking place at Loyola University between July 7th and 12th this summer. You can earn five college credits from George Mason University for successfully completing the program. Deadline to apply is January 31st. See Mr. Hayden in guidance for more details. The Green River Area Development District will host a Youth Summit on Friday, March 11th. It is open to 20 DCHS students to attend 12 leadership sessions held at OCTC from 8 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. Breakfast and lunch will be provided. See Mr. Neil Hayden in the guidance office by February 5th to register. Now stay tuned for a word about Cinderella's Closet from Ms. Kimbrell. Okay, so what is Cinderella's Closet? Um, Cinderella's Closet is an organization that I started here in Davis County a year and a half ago, and this will be our second year. So um, it is an organization to help girls attend prom that might otherwise not be able to attend prom. As you know, prom is very expensive, and dresses are very expensive. So our hopes are that we could get some dresses donated from here kids here at Davis County High School and that we could add to our collection at Cinderella's Closet. So um, that Cinderella's Closet really helps a lot of kids. It helped about 70 girls last year. Uh, what all kinds of dresses do you take? Well, you can see the one that Morgan is holding here and um, we take dresses in all colors and sizes. They can be fancy or not so fancy. We're also taking shoes, any size, and jewelry. We'd like for everything to be gently used, nothing that's completely like wore out or anything, but um, we'll take anything that people will be willing to donate. We also have uh, receipts for tax purposes. If your parents or someone would like those for tax purposes, we have those here available. So um, if anyone has any dresses or shoes or accessories that they would like to donate to us, you can bring them here to the guidance office of the Youth Service Center at Davis County High School and we'd like for you to spread the word we're gonna be taking dresses for the next two weeks. All right thank you. Cinderella's Closet of Western Kentucky is asking for your help. 
Anything is greatly appreciated and will make a huge difference. Here's what's going on today at D.C. The D.C. academic team is competing in the District Governor's Cup competition. The boys' basketball team is taking on Henderson County with the JV game starting at 6 p.m. and the varsity game at 7.30. During varsity halftime, senior bowlers will be recognized. The girls' basketball team is traveling to take on Hancock County with the JV game starting at 5.30. That's all your news for today, DC. Have a spectacular day, and we will see you tomorrow. Be like the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air and stay fresh, DC. Give me your, give me your, give me your